Podcast. 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 Man, I feel worn out. Yeah, yeah well, you sound worn out. Well, we just got back from Los Angeles. We did. Aha. Uh-huh. Well, it's been, and a, it's been, been like, a few days. Yeah, well, I know, but I feel like I just hit the ground running. Same here. Just nonstop. Yeah. Like, I didn't unpack for about three days after we got Nor home. Nor did I. I still have not unpacked. Wow. I have other clothes to wear. Okay. That's, that's a nice <laughs> well, that's, option. Yeah. Oh, okay. look at me, Mr. Fans, with all yeah. my clothes. Yeah, that's me. I'll so, just leave luggage around the house, as is. <laughs> so welcome to the podcast. Uh, yeah. Today, our sponsor is... Audible. Audible. For Thank the you. second time, Audible. They wow. like us. Do they? Or do they just like everyone? They might not know like, us. Who? Yeah, they don't know us. But I, anyway, I know we like them. Me and Johnny Audible went to school together. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. The Audible family. I didn't family. know that. Yeah. yeah. We used to play stickball. Yeah. yeah. Hey, Johnny, Johnny Audible sold me. <laughs> yeah, he no, did. No, let's not defame. Uh, <laughs> let's not do that. That was a joke. Leave it in. <laughs> All right. So, seven nights of party. Well, let's. For you. Oh, my God. Well, yeah, for me, for yeah. you, Simon. Simon, you're yeah. a madman. The we'll rest of us town. paced yes. ourselves. <laughs> Dude. No, listen, I, I want to say that well, it Duralis, was your birthday. It was my birthday. Uh-huh. Yeah. What, what, what? what? Well, Duralis, I think you partied a lot, too. You just took one night off. I didn't take one night and off. And that's my favorite story about you, night. Is it? Yeah, because uh, the night I took off to finish a video, you know, being all responsible and such, you guys went to a party. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then you got back at, who knows, midnight, one in the morning. Yep. Simon stops by my room. We talk for a little while, and uh, he's going to bed. But not so much. That's not what happened, is it, Simon? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> he ended up going out until about four in the morning still. Right. When right we had to that. be somewhere the next morning. Yeah, right. We had a stream the next morning. Yeah, yeah we did. And I was buzzed during that stream. Yeah, from no. the night before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, just saying. Worked out, though, didn't it? But we went for EA Play. Yeah. I mean, oh my God, there's so many games coming out that I want to play yeah. this year. Well, the big game that we were there for was Battlefront yeah. 2. Yes. Which... I love so far. I yeah. mean, we've only played that one level, but I already like it way much more than Battlefront 1. Yeah. Just, just because of like how I, I love the hero system. The hero system's fixed. Yeah. yeah. The hero, hero system didn't work at all for yeah. me in Battle, Battlefront 1. Not just no. heroes, but uh, vehicles yeah. and the guns. And upgrade classes. Yeah, but you just buy them with points you earn. It's like perfect. Yeah. So much easier. I also like the fact that you're just pushing in that particular map down a street. I mm-hmm. feel like you had. Yeah, it felt like Walker Assault. I mean, Walker Assault was kind of that. I just it was feel like, like this was more funneled. I feel like you weren't yeah. getting flanked constantly. Like yeah. you had to make an effort to flank. And it's okay. just that map. Yeah. That, you know, there's going to be like that many, map. many maps. There was no snow. Mm-hmm. It was pretty oh, oh, Just stop it. <laughs> bad just weather. stop it. Yeah. No diversity. I had fun playing it. I got some kills. I got to be a hero once. It was awful. Short lived. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it was short. And I was like, man, I couldn't believe it. I played as Ray. And I'm like, this is going to be great. I'm capturing the footage. I'm having, And then I'm just pulling Simon shit left and right, yeah. laughing at myself of how <laughs> typical it was. But I like the fact that I was able to become a hero. Even somebody like me can go in and play yeah, that. You and only I got, earned yeah. it. So far in the pre alpha, you only got to unlock 5,000 points. And that's not too hard to do. But once you get those points, you got to make sure no one else is using that hero. So it's not out of reach for anybody to get there. And as far as other new things, I really like that new snow map on, uh, as far as DLC, Battlefield. Can we talk about that yet? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Scratch that. Um, as far as other new games, that, uh, that prison breakout game. I'm excited about that. Yeah. By the what makers of Bro- a way Brothers. Out. A Way mm-hmm. Out. A Way Out. That looks neat. If anyone played Brothers, you, yeah. you were going to be more excited about that because that game was pretty much a work of art. Yeah. And I cried. Uh, yeah, no, it, it had a, a Pixar style ending. Yeah, made you made you cry like a bitch. Definitely. So yeah, I'm I'm excited <laughs> to play it because I like that developer. Yeah, like yeah, and I mean yeah, he got up on stage. He was really passionate. He was about awesome. It. Oh man, yeah, he yeah. was great. I thought he was wonderful. Yeah, yeah, I like the fact that he just kind of went off book and kind of got everybody excited about it. He was excited. He was so he energized. Yeah. Yeah, that when was you, real. When you stay on book, you end up like Jesse Wellens, poor guy. <laughs> no, he he can't even stay on book because <laughs> he can't read. <laughs> uh, Are we making fun of that guy that froze up? No, What's his name? no, no we no, should. No, I, mean, I mean, everybody. I mean, he's already been picked apart at this point. Right, I would have frozen for sure. Yeah, oh, that's I a lot would, of pressure. I would never man. volunteer to never. be like I'm going to be the guy that's like, hey, you guys want to check out this game? It's it always comes across. You as get cringy. numb to it if you do it. I'm sure, a bunch, but, but I don't think yeah, he it, does that. Yeah, it's easy when you have a camera in your house and you can do take after take after. To take yeah. right to me i man i wish they would like you know get rid of a lot of these speakers i mean some of them are fine but i you know just show me the games just get to the games like i mean i get they want to come out there and say things but anytime like uh, uh anyone gets up there and just starts talking i'm bored yeah Except i understand for the guy. that but i also understand especially with andrew wilson andrew wilson is the first ceo who uh has developed a game mm-hmm. he started fifa so when when it's somebody who's from that culture who's leading 
a company, a huge company. Yeah, I don't want to hear them. Then more than likely he's going to be energized about what's going on, and he he's no, he not as fine. he's not as sterile as everybody else or starchy. Yeah, you know. So other games uh, outside of EA Play. Oh man, Anyone, uh, uh, well, actually well, the well, ones I, we saw at EA Play. I want to stay on EA Play for a second. Okay, okay, yeah, Anthem we will. looks pretty interesting. Yeah, I mean they, they they showed more about Anthem at the oh, Xbox I, yeah. event, the Microsoft event. I thought we were staying on yeah. Well, I, I, I also, EA, wanted, to, I also wanted to touch on, I, to me, kind of out of left field, was uh, Need for Speed. Like, I'm usually, n I'm nowhere near interested in a Need for Speed game, but this mm -hmm. one actually looked like stupid fun. Yeah. It looked like they had, they, they brought a little uh, Burnout 3 into it's it. It's Burnout. When you wreck the cars and it goes yeah, in that slow-mo. Yeah, yeah. That intrigued me. I usually have zero interest in a Need for Speed game, but for once, I'm kind of like, I wouldn't mind trying that. Maybe more like Paradise, because it seems a little bit more open world. Yeah, I don't know. Even my wife, who was there and saw the trailer, she said... I want to play that. Yeah. Which she doesn't For, play games. Yeah. They did a fantastic job on that trailer. The sound was awesome. Yeah, it was yeah, it ridiculous. Mm -hmm. The action ridiculous, but I mean, it's like Fast and Furious that's, ridiculous. That's, that's what just, I thought of. I was like, yeah, this is Fast and sure. Furious stupid, yeah. and I'm fine with that. But yeah, Anthem looks cool. Anthem looks amazing. Yeah, I mean, it just it looks pretty. I don't. Yeah. I've only seen a little bit of gameplay. And I love the knows, flying. But. The fact that you can just fly, yeah. like and okay, fly I'm gonna take her. Yeah, and go underwater. Yeah, I mean, the exploration looks neat. I'm curious, you know, I don't know how the final game's gonna be. I guess there, it looks like either Destiny or the Division, something like that. I, I mean, I hope the enemies just don't turn into bullet sponges. Well, I the, hate I, that. Yeah, I, hate I, it so I, much. I hope the, there's like an end game there that's fun. It because... looks like they've got high hopes and and they aim for the stars with that, you know. Yeah. But that's also the concerning part because usually when that happens, time restrictions make things fall short. Star Citizen. In in a lot of cases, so I hope that's not the case here. Yeah, I hope not. And also, like I feel like games like that have like a cool world and a cool story that never gets resolved. Like yeah. Destiny, I couldn't tell you what Destiny was about. I really don't fucking know. Right? You only played it for two weeks. Yeah, yeah. but I mean, but I beat it. Like that's the thing. I was like, you I, beat I got, it? yeah, I got to the end of the no, game. I didn't beat it. I know that's the thing. The end of the game was like, hey kids, buy the DLC, and I'm like, fuck you. Like, I don't want that. I, I want to get to an end. It's like, okay, we've wrapped up this story, and now, oh, maybe we can have a sequel with the same characters and we can continue on, but wrap up what the fuck you're trying to tell me. It's tell us how you really feel. I will. <laughs> I mean, I'm a fucking gamer. Maybe I'm alone here, but um, I'm kind of just sick of, um, you know, the special space suits in all these games. Like, I know there's no other way around it, but... I'd imagine it's difficult to be like, okay, we're gonna. This is gonna be different. This one's gonna be different because this has been done and done and done. Yeah, we're gonna go with this spacesuit, but then it looks like you know, they, seventeen they, they, other. I mean, yeah. It what looks, are you gonna do? You, you could trade it out with a spacesuit from like um, anything. What's that horror game that's set in space? Oh, Deep Space. Deep, yeah, Dead Space. Dead, Dead space. space. You could trade it out with that, and I wouldn't notice. Exactly. Like, okay, it, so. it just looks like it's like the new Transformers movies. It looks like a hodgepodge of just metal. It's just all that. Like shit. it doesn't have yeah. that personality. Nothing that really, like, Master Chief sticks out. Yeah, even he looks generic. Like, if he were to come out today, though, he'd look generic. Of course. Like, I think he stuck out at the time. Yeah. But then everyone's kind of done that Master Chief design since then. Yeah. Well, it's got to look like a human body, doesn't it? Understood, yeah. I don't know what else they could do. Yeah, just Make it a big ball. A b <laughs> just a ball. Just, yeah. Ball suit. Just roll around in space. It Anthem hops. With balls. It's yeah. a ball that hops. You Why know not? What be might be cool is a suit that goes around you that's, like, made out of living, like, uh, you know, uh, plants, no, like a plant not suit. plants, but like a come on, spiders, you know, spiders. You know, suit? no, like you wear well, skin, yeah. but it's like a, a bio suit that's actually made out of living. Oh, like the aliens from Independence Day. Sounds disgusting. <laughs> Sounds gross. Yeah, I don't want to get in that. Yeah, okay, okay. You're by yourself. <laughs> but no, Anthem does look cool. I'm excited about that. Yeah. Outside of EA Play, what did you guys see that got you got you a boner? Uh, sea of Thieves. Sea of Thieves. Not coming out till early 2018, right. but we're going to be on it. Absolutely. I, I feel like that's a game all of us should play. Oh, yeah. We're going to get our pirate on for sure. Yeah. I hope it's I hope it's good. It's uh, it's Microsoft um, and it's Rare, which Rare has. Uh, they did a lot of Kinect games recently. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. taking forever. So, what? Sea of Thieves? Yeah. That's a good thing, I think. Yeah. yeah I it was know. at E3 last year. Yeah. yeah. It was at E2. I remember. Well, it was a Gamescom. Gamescom. Yeah. yeah. It was a Gamescom. Yeah. 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 I don't mind a game taking a while. That means hopefully they're putting a lot into it and yeah. it's going to be good. So, But yeah, Sea of Thieves uh, caught my eye. I'm that, excited that about cool. Far Cry 5. Far Cry 5 looks cool, yeah. Yeah, I'm excited about that story. I love story. the setting. The setting's interesting. That's very it's, intriguing it's to me. on Ubisoft's part, but very... Yep. What's yep. ballsy about it? Well, it's just kind of like the middle America. I mean, usually they set these games like, you know, in some third world country the or whatever. The enemy is a religious cult. And to me, that's why I'm not interested. It's t it just seems too backyard. 
Like, ah, eh, we got that down the street. Oh, I like that. Yeah. It's not exotic it at all. It doesn't seem like a good yeah, This is basically the Neeb story, <laughs> yeah. Neeb family story from Hickory. <laughs> yeah. Been there, done that. That's I it. Think, it's I my childhood. <laughs> I'm almost more um, drawn to want to take down that enemy because that enemy is scarier than almost anything on the planet across the world. That oh, yeah, particular yeah, yeah. type of enemy yeah, is... Yeah, using, um, using their deity to justify violence. Absolutely. Yeah, that's a worldwide problem. I'm happy to take them down. Yeah, fuck yeah. Yep. Spider-Man. I'm interested in Spider-Man. Looks cool. Oh, yeah. Spider-Man oh, looks awesome. Mm -hmm. Insomniac doing that. Uh, I, I didn't just... see that. Uh, wait. Did you not see that? I might have looked over your shoulder. You're on the phone. I saw a guy swinging. Yeah, that was probably Spider-Man. And just that's... please tell me it's the trigger. Right, shoot that trigger? way. Yeah, trigger, know. shoot that way. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll have to get but our hands just, on it. It only makes sense. Why would you do any and other the way? the double. The double does something. Yes, yeah, straightforward Slingshot. one. Yeah. Yeah, or like the old one. The spider. I mean, everyone always goes to Spider-Man 2 because it honestly had the best swinging system. But if you did the double, it would just attach to a building and you could hang there. And then, oh, you could let one go and then swing that way. It was really cool. Makes sense to me. Yeah. Great. Anything else? Anything else? Simon, what did you see that you were really interested in game-wise? The new Mario. The new Mario looks awesome. Does it? <laughs> yeah, it really does. I don't know. It's different, man. <laughs> you can't doubt them because they usually recreate themselves in pretty great ways. Like Super Mario Galaxy was mind blowing to me. Yeah, that was a lot of fun. I guess the big the big gimmick with this one is his hat. You can take his hat and oh, there's an enemy. Take your hat and throw it on top of the enemy, and now you can control the enemy. Who would who so would have like, known? Like, okay, this character from like thirty years ago is like going to be the like the, the most beloved the base video. Yeah. Yeah. of it's such still going to be here. Crazy. Well, that's Nintendo. My God, Nintendo's been riding on those characters since their inception almost. Now listen, do we not have this problem across the board? Mario's not a very creative character. I don't even think he's likable. But he's in like every he's game. Super likable. I is mean, Mickey he's Mouse just... likable? Of course, Mickey Mouse yeah, is likable. Mickey Mouse is kind of likable. How many Mickey Mouse cartoons do you like? Uh, have you seen the newer ones? You probably haven't seen the newer ones. I got some really good animation on these newer ones that Disney are producing. They're kind of like uh, three, four minute shorts. No, I've not seen those. See, well, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. Well, are, the, are the old ones good? He's no Bugs Bunny. No, no, no. no Bugs, Bugs Bunny is better. Yeah, yeah I much agree better. With you there. Right? But I don't hate Mickey Mouse. But like, there's these icons that are huge. Like Mickey Mouse is this huge icon. Mm -hmm. Not very good in his cartoons. I just think people tie a quality game to Mario at this point. It doesn't even matter yeah, because that it's Nintendo. Mario. But my yeah. point it's going to be fun to play. Like Mario is not that interesting of a character. Doesn't I, matter. I think as far like uh, yeah, but they make good games with that character. Yeah, the character doesn't need to be anything because it's basically you representing that character. You control the actions of that character. Neebs, I think it could have been. Link. I mean, his character is just basically oh, the bad princess. Oh, I got something to save her. Oh, yeah, I think the reason why <laughs> Neebs, you probably don't think he's that likable of a character is because he doesn't have a real voice. And you hate Italians. You do hate Italians. Yeah, you know, despise right. them. Yeah. I'm surprised no, like Simon works so. here. I know. Well, I'm half Italian. He told me I was a half no. boy. I was okay. And we'll, we'll find out. You. We'll find I like out the, if you I like the Italian part of you. It's the rest of you I don't like. Oh, you don't like the Irish? <laughs> wow. No, I like the Irish part. Oh, fight, it's just my fight, 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 God, we're kiss, tired, huh? Kiss, fight, 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 fight. Change of subject. Back to the trip. We had a meetup. What? I was going to... One more game. One more oh, game. Sorry. One more, one more. It's Shadow one more Mordor. Game. Go. The Shadow one. Mordor looks good. You like that? The new one looks really, really good. You, you can happy? take control of like your enemies. Yeah. And you throw your hat them. on them. <laughs> yeah. You throw your hat on them. This one has a sombrero. What a princess. And you have like a suit. A human looking suit. Human suit. Just like all the other games. <laughs> did you guys see the God of War trailer? Anyone see that? I did. Is there I a didn't. new one? Yeah. They put a God of War trailer out last year. I saw the old one. Yeah, well, no, this is still, this is the new God of War. I'm not. It's like they're going Logan with it. Yeah, it feels, it doesn't feel like, I, I associate the God of War games, you remember the one we played? Yeah. With just big, crazy action. And they seem to have lost that. Kratos is in a rest home now. Yeah. I thought that was he's an like, interesting. Oh, he's angle. old. He's got a kid, and yeah, it could be a good game. I'm hoping for a good story, but collecting disability. Like, I, he's I trying miss, to take Jello that, from the other guys. I don't know. I, I just miss seeing him take down these giant so, creatures. Considering what insane. he's defeated in the past, why would anything mess with him? Surely that word Honestly, gets yeah. around in the yeah. local publications. People forget, man. Especially the little guys. The little one-off characters yeah, you fight on the run. way. Like, oh shit, it's Kratos. Oh, and he has a kid now. I should run. Yeah, I'm not going to try to fight him. Kratos has a positive. Are we going to talk about games all day? No, no we're going to move on. Simon was going to say, Is this a gaming channel? Else? I'm confused. Yeah, no, no. Hold on. Before we go any further, I want to talk about our sponsor because support for today's show comes from Audible. And Audible's content includes an unmatched selection of audiobooks, original audio shows, news, comedy, and more from leading publishers, broadcasters, entertainers, and business information providers. Unlike any streaming or rental service, with Audible, 
You own your books so you can access them anytime, anywhere from almost any device, including your iPhone, iPad, Android, Amazon Fire, tablets, or Windows Phone. Plus, thanks to the great list and guarantee, if you don't like your title, you could swap it for a new one. Not to mention, Audible channels give you a collection of exclusive originals, short stories, and comedy so you can always have something new to listen to. And I'm all about the comedy. And I just saw on there the other day when I was on, I saw uh, Dr. Katz which was a cartoon back in the day that I loved. And now it's back on Audible with like new stuff. And he's a psychiatrist and he's talking to comedians and other famous people. And it's funny as hell. And if you guys know like Archer, H. John Benjamin, Bob's Burgers, like he was, that was the first time I ever heard him in anything. That was a great show. And now I get to listen to new stuff on Audible. So I just suggest you check it out. And if it's something that you guys are interested in, you get a free audiobook with a 30-day trial at www.audible.com slash Neebs. That's www.audible.com slash N-E-E-B-S for a free audiobook with your 30-day trial. Thank you, Audible. And I forgot what we were talking about. What were we talking about? Back to, EA, or back to uh, LA. Well, we had a meetup. And that was fun. What a great meetup. Great meetup. There was probably, we don't know, I, I think the numbers vary people from, there. from 30 to 3,000 people showed up. Somewhere in there. We should have done a head count. And it turned out to be the perfect venue for a meetup. It mm-hmm. was by accident. Yeah. We're like, where should we meet? I don't know. Let's mm-hmm. go back to the hotel. That was easiest. Right. Yeah. But it wasn't hotel, an accident. I said the hotel bar. You accidentally said it, yeah, though. Yeah, I did accidentally. Okay, right. I stumbled across that phrase. <laughs> like, well, we're at a hotel. Where, we have a bar. Where you picked was an accident. The reason it was perfect was an accident. No, that's the reason why I picked it why? because all ages could come. Hmm. Did he I didn't say know that? that. Did I he say that? I don't have to say it. It's just it. common sense. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I feel like it, it turned out like it was genius. He, he He's like, oh wait, he that was my idea. This is why. For this. Yeah. No, I'm just saying that. That's why I thought of it. You were and wonderful. It, and there was no admission to come in. Wow, thick is smart. Thick Listen, is smart. Yeah. <laughs> great idea, buddy. And I'm serious. That was a great idea. No, Thank you. It was a really good idea. Thank you. Even though you left five minutes. There was at least two people there that were under 21. A guy came with his two sons. Yeah, and two I, and tall, I, two tall, handsome young men, <laughs> sixteen and nineteen, I believe. And the father was maybe a bigger fan. We d- we didn't know if he was just being a good dad. He's a very stoic man. But, but he was. He was. He's seen everything. Yeah, Neves gaming related. And introduced his boss to us, who also watches us now. And they don't game. They don't game. As don't, far as I they know, they don't have he, to. We do it. He doesn't game. Yeah, we got it covered. One of the kids. Uh, I don't remember anyone's name. I was intoxicated. Um, but when I was talking to them when I was like, Hey, so what are you guys into? I'm like being all, you know, Hey, look at me, bada bing. Like I do when I go to kids uh-huh. parties. Yeah. Right. Wearing so, his vomit tie. Yeah. yeah. So I'm like, well, what do you do? One of, one of them had a, uh, one of them had a quarter behind his ear. Yeah. <laughs> I remember you found it. <laughs> right. <laughs> look at this. One of them got your nose. One of them was into the whole, he was like the news, news guy at his school, uh, news that they have there, yeah, I guess. Yeah, that was his title, I remember. That was, yeah, news, news guy. guy. At his yeah. school news. No, but he was good. He was into that shit. They were going to give him his own show. He was into like improv and stuff. He was into the creative stuff. And the guy's other son, his brother, had a channel, a YouTube channel, had like 8,000 subs. His uh, channel name was Accelerator, oh, I wow. believe. So Start I want to get X, right? Accelerator. Yes. So yeah. I want to, we'll, uh, I'll get the correct spelling. Shout out to Accelerator. And we're going to yeah. give the shout out and go give them some Neebs Gaming love. Be- because they deserve it. They're, they seem like just oh, great, yeah, no, they genuinely were great. great people. Yeah. yeah. Every, uh, everybody that showed up there was great. Oh, we had, sure. We had a couple of guys that felt really, were very quiet at the beginning. Mm-hmm. But then by the end of it, it everyone's just on. having, yeah, it was like, it was one big happy family. What was the one dude's name? Jose? Jose. Yeah, Jose. <laughs> Super quiet in the beginning, and by the end, it was just like, oh, this this guy's your brother. I wish I could remember everybody. It was, I mean, Speed I know. Eraser was there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Cerebral Emesis was there. And Dicecom there. Gabby was there. And MQB. Dicecom Dice was Dice there. Dicecom. And MQB and his woman. Yeah, his woman was so quiet, and then all of a sudden, you it couldn't was on shut her up. Sassafras <laughs> City. <laughs> in a good way. It was great. Man. Yeah, she was sassy. Azure Shadow. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Steak showed up for a little bit. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Oh, end date. Yeah, oh, yes. hey, that's right. Yeah. I tried to avoid him, but I ran into him. You know, because he stood me up. <laughs> yep. Oh, right. A while back. It's awkward. Yeah. You can stand up next time. Yeah, okay. No, but that was great. No, oh, no. I was, yeah. I, was, uh, I was happy that people from the community showed up. Only three glasses were broken. Yes, and... Uh, Simon led the way. I led the way, yes. Mm-hmm. And I was so... It was that I miss, feeling... I have a picture. You, somebody has a picture of me. I do. I'm, I'm looking <laughs> yeah. down... I'm looking down at the... I can't show Yeah, like you me. just pooped on the carpet. Yeah, because there's nothing worse. Like, every single night when I was there... That's why I partied every night. Because every night, 
was the perfect buzz. It was like, oh, great. I just just yeah. was having such a good time. I don't want to go to bed. But when I dropped the glass, it was like, the man, I want to clean this up. I feel so bad. Yeah. Like, I don't want anybody to clean up after shame, me. Shame. On the back, cook apps for everybody. Yeah. Feel bad. Uh, can I bring up something that was one of the greatest laughs I've had in a good while that yeah. happened that night? Mm -hmm. I, I know you remember, but uh, we're looking at this picture. I don't remember who took the picture. I, but it, I, I it was a nacho. Was, one I think it was mofo. Tommy from Two Angry Gamers. Tommy from Two Angry <laughs> Gamers took the picture of, of Nacho, him and uh, Beaker. And, then Selena. Mofo. and then I immediately I saw, yeah, as like that looks like Beaker, <laughs> and <laughs> because the light, the backlight from, like, from the Muppets, yeah, yeah, from the Muppets, like blocked off two sides of his head, and he's a very very pale individual with red so hair. So it like shaped his head right, and his face yep. was exactly Beaker ish. It was, so good. It was fucking hilarious. Uh, I, I still have never seen Nacho. it. Yeah, Nacho is good people. Nacho yeah. is yeah. If you like watching. Uh, battlefield first person shooter footage cheesy mofo of good gameplay yeah oh he's a console guy yeah too. he plays yeah. on playstation a lot yeah mm -hmm. he's a very good gamer and he's a good guy and he bought me on my birthday he bought me three god i went to gas station hot dogs oh, god, it was awful. <laughs> which you ate all three of them oh no i didn't i ate two of them the next day i woke up on on top of the bed with my shoes on <laughs> That's what you know. I, I woke you up. With a hot dog left. You ate yeah, the with a hot dog, hot dog on the floor in the box still. The other two <laughs> boxes were empty. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, <laughs> lordy, lordy, lord. Yeah. And it wasn't until later that day I told you, Nacho bought you there. You're like, oh, that's right. Yeah, that's, that's right. <laughs> that's right. I knew I went there, but I didn't know anyone was with me. Real quick, can I, can I just insert a disclaimer here? Yeah. Guys and gals, if you're going to drink, drink responsibly. I know yeah. a lot of what we talk about is alcohol influence. Yeah. And, uh, and hey, we, we try to drink responsibly, but Be do the age, same. Don't and drive. Don't drive. But, oh, of course uh, not. Yeah. No. Get your now, some on. nights you party. I had one night where it hit me really hard. That was when we were at that one of that, that rooftop party. That's because of the drinks they were serving. Yeah. These they had too much drinks. sugar. Well, I don't it know. It wasn't if it was, like we oh, were just sugar fucks your world. It wasn't out. like we drank too much. It was just that sugar. Yeah. Well, yeah. Go ahead. Some, speak for yourself. He drank too much. And again, kids, I did. You shouldn't. Exactly. But, you know, yes. sometimes, sometimes it does. I was does partying. Happen. I was having a good time. Those drinks were delicious. And then uh, that was at that Madden party or whatever. No, nope, that was the NBA live party. Okay, NBA live party. That was sports. There was there was a ball. There was a ball, ball, there was a ball, ball there. there. I know that. Ball party. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I remember going up to Simon. It's like, get me out of here. Yeah. He's like, need to go home. I am so. Oh, listen, Why would I don't you know go what's to going Simon on for that because and he guess has what? the worst record. No, no, no he was no, around. He was there. He was in what I found yeah, first. And what did I do? I you took got me care of you. Yeah, because I said, "Don't worry, buddy. I know that you're, <laughs> I know the things you. are you're out of hand right now." I said, "You're with me. I got you." And he and he just held well, on. This, 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 no, going to get gas no, this station was, hot dogs. No, this was the <laughs> same night. Everything will be fine. This coming. This was the same night that he he ended up staying out to four a.m. Yeah. So this was pre when he came back. Yeah, but don't get me wrong. I was. Yeah. Oh yeah. No, Kids yeah. don't drink. And after, then you were. He gave him a piggyback ride the rest of the night. Yeah, that was, was sweet oh, yeah. of you. Uh, we went to a party a few nights later. It was Dralis's turn to order the Uber, and he gets the smallest oh, Uber Jesus <laughs> in the whole <laughs> fleet for all five of us. You know what's funny? It's <sighs> your <laughs> smart cars. How about the party? The party yeah, was great. You're party skipping was great. the fact yeah. that it was at the top of the maze. It's only going to be the maze bank building to me. Uh, it all will I never be. The car ride home. Yeah. Really? All that's all you remember? No. Not the, that, not the that slide party was on the, the outside of the building? No, I'm joking. That that party was the coolest place I've ever yeah, been right. to a party. So yeah. if you know party, GTA, yeah. it was the Maze Bank building. We yep. were on the 70th floor, and on either side or a few sides of the building, you could go out to a patio, and there was the wall was six foot tall glass, glass wall, wall. You yeah. see everything. so you could just see everything. A helicopter flew by eye level. Like you could have thrown a, I could have thrown a baseball and hit it. I remember, yeah, watching the sunset from up there made me very happy. I mm -hmm. love it. I, it I, was. I, I'm a woman sometimes. I love a good sunset. I don't know if that's a woman thing. I think that's a human thing. Maybe. Yeah. Thank you, Mr. Braddock. Thank you, Mr. Mitri. Thank you, oh, e everyone. Yeah. Other yeah. people, too, Rob, for Rob bringing us out. Rob. Yeah. Rob Nils. made that party Nils. happen Nils. for us. Yeah, yeah Rob. Way. I want to kiss Nils on the mouth. I want to kiss Nils. Rob on the mouth, too. I want to do more than kiss him. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's make that the next segment. What do we want to do to Rob and Nils? Okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> we'll start with his shoes. I want to take off his shoes. Rob's mm. that is, and I want to have Nils watch me take off oh, Rob's shoes. Go on, pour, milk him. I want to oh. pour gravy on his socks. Oh Ooh. God, you knew, you knew uh, I'm into gravy, gravy <laughs> stuff. Sock gravy. Can we talk about? Can we talk about the so, slide? <laughs> so yeah, very I didn't do it. Uh, it was lackluster. I did it. it was... yeah, but it's cool. No, the idea yeah. is cool. It's too but short. It's but very the fact gimmicky. that there's a glass slide that goes from like the seventieth floor around the building to the the next floor down. The next floor down. It's only it only takes what. 
10 seconds to do the slide. If they had only doubled the length of that slide, we're talking, I mean, what was it, 20 feet? It was three seconds yeah, to do two, the slide. Two I watched things it. to me. It was like double the length, and you had to sit on a mat. Yeah. And so when you look down, all you see is the mat. Yeah. Like if you didn't have the mat there and you could actually look down and see, yeah, but it was I'm too scraped stories anyway. up. It was too scraped. Oh, yeah. you know it's what I mean? Kind of, yeah. So it became cloudy a little bit. You couldn't but really even take cloudy a... is a lot scarier than the black mat that they Agreed. had you going down Agreed. on. Agreed. I still had fun. By the time oh, yeah, I was, yeah. Yeah. It was it was it was fun for sure. It's By the just, time it's just you're a cool thing to do. Yeah, registering in your surroundings on the slide, you're at it's the over. bottom. Yeah, That's why fast. I wish it was twice as long because now you're taking it in for at least three more seconds. I did it once while the sun was out, once at night. Oh yeah, boy. Did. Yeah. Did you guys do uh, karaoke? No. no, I wish I would have because we it, had was, to leave early. it was a live band. Yeah, we, I know. We yeah. left early because we had to wake up super early. So to otherwise we would have we would have been singing our sing songs. Yeah. How great was that Uber ride though, huh? <laughs> yeah, back to the the highlight <laughs> oh, of the evening. Four yeah, of us in the Uber. back of like what was it? Like a Honda. Wow, it isn't so it tiny. crazy that I hit the wrong button? Yeah. <laughs> That's so <laughs> That's crazy. Crazy. Wow. Yeah. Huh. And then we got back and we hung out with uh who was that? Who's the rapper? Oh yeah, we hung out corrupt? with corrupt, corrupt. We were corrupt hanging out and like his I, uncle yeah. and he was doing a fan meetup. <laughs> yeah, <hotel lobby. laughs> he had like half the people we did. Dude, Dude he was cool as people. shit. Do you remember though, corrupt's uncle when we first walked in? Oh, Absro. oh yeah, he got mad at me. Yeah, he's talking shit to Absro, and we we're like buzzing and having a great time. We we're gonna have one more beer. We thought he was kidding. Yeah, and yeah. he wasn't. He was not kidding. Yeah, he yeah. thought you pushed him aside for you to get by. But in all actuality, and we know this wasn't true, he was like stepping back and you were just like making sure he knew you were there. Yeah, I just like put my hand on his back like, whoa, hey, man, I'm, just, I'm getting by you. It, it, whatever, yeah. it was a misunderstanding. Oh, Later, weird. Uh, Corrupt was cool as shit. And Corrupt was one of the big boys at Death Row Records, like one of the top two or three guys. And, you know, back with Pac and, and Snoop and all that stuff, Corrupt's seen some shit. And yeah. he offered to score one of our videos. I shit you not. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what do you do? I'm like, we do gaming videos. I swear to God, I have his cousin's phone number. Yeah. Dude, He's like, you be... never know. I'm like, okay. So, wait, he's like, hey, I'll, I'll score one of your gaming videos. And you're like, yeah, that's weird. You probably shouldn't do that. Or how did you react? Well, I said, well, it's not really the genre of what your music is not really fitting for, like, let's just say if we're doing ARC. And he's like, you don't know what I do. Or, like, I could do, like, you know, like, <laughs> I could do anything. Yeah. I'll, do, I'll do anything. And I was like, yeah. okay. All right. We're going to build sure. silly cars and scrap yeah. mechanic. Go. Yeah. Under my breath. No budget. But, like, sure. <laughs> look, at, look at Jeep stuff. Yeah. We do music. That could happen. That was hip hop. Oh, we should have had him listen to that. Yeah. <laughs> that would have been great. All right. Well, stay tuned for uh, yeah, corrupt. potential corrupt mm -hmm. collaboration. Yeah, collaboration. So what do we got? We I feel like we didn't cover a lot of bases. We went bowling one night. I don't know if that's worth talking about. Ugh. I know I had a lot of fun. I couldn't walk for four days after. I, I, I left early. That was the night I, I, I couldn't. It was too I could, loud. I couldn't take that place, man. It's too loud. Yeah, no, it was too loud. Here. But you threw up that night. You were throwing up that day. No, no, that was the next day. Oh wait, no, you're right. No, yeah, you were that sick was, it was that, that day. Was, that was that day. So yeah, maybe that on top of it. But yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't have a conversation with anybody. Your that 80 place. year old came out that night. Yeah, look, I don't Do like yelling at people. Do y'all have a hard time? I can't. I can't hear people in loud places. Yeah. It, no, if, it's I can't either. if I plug my ears up, I can. But if my ears are open, it's just noise. It was loud. No it was doubt. loud. But I had a fun the time. DJ. The yeah. DJ was playing some great songs, though. Cool bowling alley, too. Yeah. It had like this old wood. There's a giant like bookshelves. And the only thing that made it feel like a bowling alley were the bowling lanes. Yeah. No, Lucky Strike is well known yeah. in, in Hollywood for kind of being a hot spot. A yeah, place pretty, where a lot of companies have parties. It's like yeah, $70 it was, a oh, game we got or something. To, uh, Damn. That was like our third night. Second or third. But I saw some people for the first time there. Yeah. Like uh, Squid and Wheezy. Ran yeah. Those yeah. Guys. yeah. Squid and Wheezy. Also YouTubers that we've those kind guys of are great. Mm -hmm. bumped into a few times. And you know it's them because it says it on their hats. They had, yeah. they had hats. They did. We need to get hats. <laughs> hats with <laughs> yeah. their names on them. Yeah. It's a good idea. Pants with, oh, pants with our, like jeans with our names across our ass. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah. Juicy Airbrushed. Airbrushed. Where it would say Hot pants. pants. <laughs> Mine would wrap around to my front side. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> That's a long name. Yeah. No, it fit on your butt. <laughs> Sing! <laughs> 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 zow, zowie, woo! Uh, good stuff. Not really. <laughs> Neves' name would be spelled wrong and he would spell it. That's right. <laughs> uh, I, was I don't like being told how to spell. You don't. Oh, you hate the English language and alphabet and all it that really stuff. It really could be improved. Give me a couple of days. Silent K. It's 
It's ridiculous. And yeah, uh, no, um, no thieves were taken down, but Thick and I did help a man push his truck to the side of the yes. road. Yes, well done. Yes, uh, and, and broke down in traffic. And I just like to say this: you had to get off a bus to do this. As I did, well. but it, yeah, if people, I don't understand why people just sit and watch that shit and then complain and honk like. Fucking help the dude. Get help. Right. Yeah. Get to the side of the road and move on and feel better about yourself. And yeah. he's happy and not in the middle of all that shit. It's like, it blows my mind. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you see that happening, so we've all been there. Help somebody. Oh, yeah. We've broken down. Yeah. yeah. And it's a sh- it sucks. Mm-hmm. And when people help you get off to the side of the road, then it's so much better. And it's proof that you are a better person than Thick. Yeah, this because scenario. he let... He That's led not the, why I brought it up. No, no, no. no, I, no, no I, go ahead. Because uh, Duralius led the charge. We were sitting there. He's like, you know what? I'm going to go help that guy. He got off the bus, sitting there watching him help the guy, and something happened where the guy didn't turn right. or he didn't something, turn right, and freak, all of a sudden he was and, out in traffic and again. And then they were trying to push the car from the front. <laughs> you should have yelled at him. Duralius, what are you doing? <laughs> Sorry. So Duralius was, he was wearing his, uh, he couldn't get a lot of traction with your, with your flip flops. Flip flip but that's, And I was like, I can't issue. let him take all the credit yeah. for this. To be fair. <laughs> and I, right. I said, this is not going to, yeah. I better jump in there. I better jump into action and save the day. So we, we got out there, we helped the guy. And it you was, put on it your was, cape. I did. <laughs> it's trusty go-to cape for such situations. And, and my hot pants. Cape. It was so big on you, it was dragging on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> and it was a napkin. Yeah. <laughs> See? I looked like Stuart the Mouse. Uh, there you go. probably would have right. been there sooner had he seen over the window. Oh, yeah. yeah, he didn't know what was happening. God. <laughs> All right. All right. Enough of that shit. But you know, uh, Tommy Rage, Tommy yeah. and I were at a bar, and some guy. This this was the night that I went back out till four. We we're having a good time, and some guy started doing magic in the bar. And long story short, uh, he did a good m- trick. What knew was it? No, it wasn't me. But he was doing the trick to me, and Tommy was sitting there watching the trick. So at some point, he he, I thought oh, he screwed God. up the trick. Yeah. I was like, oh, you got it wrong. <laughs> we laugh and like, shit, that's not his card, whatever. Ends it up, it was in my pocket, the card. He had placed the card that it was supposed to be inside my front pocket. But Tommy said he got pickpocketed like after 250 that. 250 bucks. 250 bucks wow. out of his wallet. The guy oh, picked his shit. And Tom had his wallet in his like side sweatshirt pocket, which is a horrible place to put a right. wallet. Yeah. Took the money out, put the wallet back in. Like and I was like, oh magic. shit! Are you sure? That was an expensive magic show. Tommy was sure. Tommy gets pretty crazy sometimes. He does though. get crazy in the best way. Yeah. No, in the best way. But he he might have spent that on a a rare <laughs> bottle of champagne yeah. ten minutes right. before that. <laughs> well, you you know what? Yeah, rare uh, bottle of ketchup. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I made a a life change. If you haven't noticed, probably not. I guess I've been carrying my wallet in my front pocket instead of my back pocket. Mm. You changed to the front. Change the front pocket. Right here. And you put yeah. it right over your, your nuts. Nope, that's not I a pocket. It was a... The groin pocket. <laughs> but no, but that should be a pocket. Uh, the floppy edge. from... Be. Yeah, the from, bullet. From Dice. Yeah. yeah. He was like, no, this is where you want... You want to keep it in the front. It's safer. It's better for your back. And it, it is better for sense. your back. I mm-hmm. found like when I'm when I'm like driving for long periods of time or just yeah. sitting at a computer, I'm like, God, but... This is common sense this stuff. Is, it's like sitting on a rock is going to be bad. It's the same thing. Yeah. You've been putting the wallet in your back pocket all like this a, time? Like a crazy freak. Are you crazy? Yeah. Yeah. Tons Are of you people nuts? do the back pocket. But it gets pocket. bigger and well, bigger because of, of my coupons. Where's yours? Yeah. Front pocket. I coupon like crazy, yeah. <laughs> coupons? Oh, you're a couponer. All my, all my, all my Peter Delight coupons. Coupons. And Tropical Smoothie Cafe. Yeah. Double coupon day on nice. Thursdays. No, oh, yeah. Peter. Coupons is fun to say. Coupon. It? Yeah. It, that's like an old Southern lady word. Got it. Got to clip my coupons. <laughs> that's it. Can we end? I think that's a good end. Right there, the that, coupon, coupons. That was it. Oh, yeah. That's a big yeah. crowd yeah. pleaser. Is that good? The coupons. Do, all right. Well, if we're done with the trip, we should touch on Patreon because we're getting like mad yeah. love. Hey, wow. oh, Thank you guys so much. Jesus Christ. Christ. Thank you wow. so much. And and let's lay. I want to. I want to say right off the bat. Like some, very few people might think this means something different for them on YouTube if they're not. Nope donating doesn't mean a damn all thing all videos yeah. will still be on youtube they should just be, like before yeah it's actually going to be better for you because we're just trying to make better content that you can get for free uh we we were a bit hesitant we're like should we launch this patreon how are people going to react and we like we we got to do it because when we come in to record man it's a struggle for time like yeah so if we have more people we can start pushing some of our editing to them so we can record more 
and just and some of our editing because other people are like, no, new editors, it's not going to be the same. It's no, going to be still no. Wanna edit. I love yeah. editing. Yeah, Me too. And, oh, hell yeah. And if other people do edit, they're going to learn from us, and we're always going to be looking at what's going on beforehand. No There's matter. There's going to be approval process, and we're going to delegate course. it appropriately. So thank you guys once again. Yeah. No, we're just gonna we're gonna dump that back into the company and make more videos, better videos, etc. And we're gonna make up a song right now and sing it. What? Just for you. Hit it, Simon. I need I need music. Wait, this is your idea. No, no, you just you say it. Keep it. Well, thank you, patrons, for your help. We love you so damn much. Evening. Huh? Shit. <laughs> Man, there it goes. It's yeah. a tough. Uh, it's a tough thing to just improv with. You yeah, know, it is. The, the slower. <laughs> That's like squirt boxing. You will it's not beatboxing. <laughs> <laughs> Get, get, get.